One year since the killing of George Floyd and the impact of his death is being felt in many ways, including by many artists who found creative ways to express their emotions in a lasting way. News 12 New Jersey's John Bathke has more. Artist Lorenzo Pickett has created many portraits, but the one he painted of George Floyd came from his soul, he says. It just went past the physical and uh, it just touched me in a profound way. Pickett says he was on an emotional roller coaster in the days after seeing video of Floyd's murder. That haunted me and um, I couldn't, I actually couldn't sleep for two days and in the midst of not being able to sleep, I painted that portrait. He's not alone. The emotional response by artists is still visible one year later in public art and in galleries where exhibits themed on social justice have gone up in recent months. That's one of the processes that I do. That's with me stepping back and seeing what it is that I'm creating. Pickett of Jersey City says painting an image of George Floyd with the words, air is the most precious gift we share, was a healing experience. I wouldn't consider myself an artist if I didn't help articulate George Floyd's story, if I didn't participate in what was going on. What do you hope people get from this painting? What do you hope they feel from it when they see it? I hope that they feel compassion um, and empathy for another human being. Yeah. Just thinking about it, it makes me emotional. One year later, the emotions that poured onto the canvas are still palpable. In Jersey City, John Bathke, News 12, New Jersey.